My name is Dr. Eric Storch. Uh, I'm a professor in the All Children's Hospital Guild Endowed Chair. Uh, and, and the lab, uh, which I direct, is focused on working with children with autism and comorbid anxiety, uh, obsessive compulsive disorder, and children with anxiety disorders. The research in particular hits on several different areas. So one of them is trying to understand what types of psychotherapies are most effective uh, for each of these populations. A second is trying to figure out how we can get those types of therapies out into the community. And then a third is trying to figure out some of the ways that the therapies work and if we can target some of those mechanisms to make treatment work more effectively. There are a number of things that I love about uh, this line of research. One of my favorite is, is that I'm able to work with kids and their families who are struggling with these problems. Another thing that I love is working with trainees. Being able to, to contribute to their training um, is something that I, I find endlessly rewarding. So I was born in Gainesville, Florida, and then we shortly after ended up moving up to upstate New York in a small town. When I was in high school, I, I was interested mostly in playing soccer and a little bit of school. A lot of my, my experiences came uh, during the summer uh, where I would travel to, to different settings and work in, uh, in summer camps, sometimes for children uh, within an inner city, sometimes just for typically developing children. One of those challenges is, is dealing with funding availability uh, through our government. It's very challenging to get research grants, um, especially for newer investigators. The same thing when you write a paper. You may think this is the most important paper you've ever written, and someone else says, nope, uh, not at all, and you get a rejection letter to that. What fascinates me about the work that we do um, is that there never seems to be an end to it. That, for example, we could develop a new type of psychotherapy to address a particular problem area, but then we have to have the challenge of, of ensuring this accessible to everyone. And even when it's accessible, there'll be people who don't benefit. And there's the question of why don't they get help uh, from this and how can we ensure that they do. Um, that part is, is, for me, really exciting. One of the things that I think is really, really coming on these kids who have Tourette is this impulsivity that's driving some of the suicide. It's a very simple goal in terms of what I hope to achieve. It's to, to help people. Uh, my father taught me early on that, that the mark of a person is, is who they help. To me, what matters is, is that we're able to change a child's life um, and set their trajectory in a more positive path. There are several, several pieces of advice that I'd give to someone who wants to pursue a career in uh, psychology and psychiatry. The first is start getting experience right away. Um, so starting from the undergraduate uh, or even high school setting, get experience shadowing, um, get experience in research labs. The second is um, try to present, try to write things, um, work with faculty members uh, who are doing those things so you can um, get some of those experiences. Mm -hmm.